Hi guys, this is Abhi from Gokche DB. In this video, you're going to learn how to enable X-ray tracing for Lambda functions in AWS. Let's start by navigating to the Lambda service, then click on create function and give it a name. Choose Python for runtime, then hit create. Click on add trigger and choose S3 as your source. I'm going to select a test bucket, then acknowledge the recursive warning, then hit add. Next, navigate to the code tab and add a print statement for the event so we can see it in the logs, then hit deploy. Go to the configuration tab, then click on monitoring and operations tools. Click edit, then enable active tracing in the AWS X-Ray section, then click on save. Now let's navigate to the S3 service and upload a file to our test bucket. This will trigger our Lambda function and then we can analyze it using X-Ray. Looks like our file was successfully uploaded. Let's go back to the Lambda window and navigate to the Monitor tab. Click on View Logs in CloudWatch, then go inside the log stream. Here in the logs, we can confirm that this invocation was triggered when we uploaded the test.txt file. Let's head back and this time, click on View X-ray Traces in Service Lens. Scroll down to the Traces section, then go inside the latest trace. Here you can see a trace map and a segments timeline. You can also switch the nodes from the icons to a metrics view. In the segments timeline, the dwell time will tell you how long it's spent waiting to execute. Similarly, you can look at initialization, invocation, and overhead durations. To look at the underlying data of the traces, click on Raw Data. Finally, to analyze the traces further, click on the Actions dropdown, then hit Analyze Traces. There you have it. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.